How did you spend your time between season one and season two? <laughs> Wondering what delicious things am I going to come up with for me to do in season two. <laughs> Like, how was your family's reaction to season one? They loved it. Absolutely loved it. Uh, they were so surprised. And immediately, and of course, you know, your family can be biased. But I have a little cousin. Her friend, she's in, she's in the sorority I'm in. And her friends in college are like over the moon for this show. And they're saying it's their favorite show. And I'm like, oh, you're just saying that because we're related? She said, no, they mean it. Yeah. And then if you could cross On My Block over with any other Netflix show, which one would you want it to be? I'm sorry, say it again? If you could have a crossover episode with any other... Oh, if you could have a crossover episode with any other Netflix show... Have I been on any other show? No, like if you could have... Like when Scooby-Doo would like team up with Abbott and Costello. Like any other Netflix show teaming up with On My Block. Oh gosh, my imagination just went crazy. <laughs> oh, I have, uh, I have like, I have a very strange imagination. So Santa Clarita Diet meets on my block. <laughs> Don't eat the enchiladas. <laughs> we know where the money and the bodies are buried. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to say you have the best answer so far. And then, what would you like for your character in the future? To continue on the show. <laughs> yeah, I, I want to see Abuelita live a long life with the kids and watch them grow up, you know. Um, uh, she, she's, uh, she's a very rich character. She loves those kids. And I really would like to see her watch them grow up, maybe even have their own kids. You never know. My pleasure. All right.